on my previous video, I showed you all six sword styles from this Demon Slayer game. Now is the turn of the demons. I'm going to show you all 10 demon arts. Are you ready? Let's go. Where the actors slam on oh, their dancing forward. There's your slam. There's the dump. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. For those who are asking, I'm going to post AFS video tomorrow, okay? Thank you for being patient. So for the first demon art, we're gonna focus on the string art which cost 50,000 cash. Again, we are going to be needing an ore and wood. Okay, so for the first skill, there you go, you see that the red thing. Second skill, this one. No worry, I'm going to give you an example on how those skills work. For the third skill, this one. So if you know the demon who uses this art, comment it on the comment section. That's it for the first skill, you are going to pull your enemy towards you. Uh, a good skill for doing combos. This one, the second skill. This is a long range skill. There you go, for luring enemies maybe. And for the last skill, there you go. As long as I think your enemy is within your two strings, you can damage it. So for a good combo, I think second skill first. The, the R skill, E, and D. E. Alright, that's it. Again, 50,000 cash. Next stop. Again, you need the Mishirin ore, the wood, and the money. Next stop, we're gonna use the Bursting Blood art. I think this is the art used by Nezuko, right? In Demon Slayer. That's the first skill. So, if, if you know something about Nezuko, she is very good or her powers are stronger with blood, right? From the name itself. So, I'm gonna show you how this works. That's the first skill. Gamer no, we did not show the third skill. Why? Don't worry, I'm going to show it to you. There you go, that's the second skill. This the third skill will only work if your enemy is bleeding. See that? The enemy is bleeding. There you go. Okay? That's it. Next art. What is our next art? Okay, we have the swamp art. There you go. So that's the first skill. Wherever your cursor is pointing, you can teleport in that area. Again, there. Swamp art first skill. There you go. Second skill. Hmm. Okay, this is in Naruto. This is Kage Bunshin. Guys, I really don't know what's the use of this. Maybe just to think uh, you're running away or etc. or as a diversion. But guys, I tried it in front of an enemy, but the enemy is still attacking me. Even though I lured the enemy towards this uh, replicas, etc. or illusions or whatever. They're still not helping me or the enemy is not attacking it. So I really don't know the use of it. The third skill. What's that third skill? There you go. A stun. Okay. So if you stun, swamp art. Do you like it guys? Comment it in the comment section. So next up, we have the vector arrow art. Guys, this is one of the coolest or fun arts to use. Check that out in the arms. Oh, I mean the hands. There you go. There's a line. That's the first skill. I'm going to show you how to use it later. That's the third skill. Give me no more second skill. Don't worry. We're gonna use it. That's the first skill. One more time. There you go. <laughs> the second, I, yeah, the second skill, guys. See that? You'll make the enemy turn. And that's the last skill. Everyone who's hit by your arrows, multiple arrows, will fly away. Next up, we have the Timari art for 25,000 cash. There you go. Guys, the ball, the first skill, that's the ball. If you don't hit anything, it will come back to you. But you won't catch it. I don't know why. I think they need to improve that part. If you hit someone, there you go. That's the first skill. The second skill, you will just throw three balls. First skill, one ball, this one, three balls. For the third skill, you will jump and throw a ball. I think that has a higher damage. There you go. And that's it for the Temari art. Next up, we have the Chizumi Drums art for 23,000 cash. Guys, this one's the coolest for me. First skill, guys, we are the one getting attacked, okay? By our main character out there. Why? I want to show you what happens when your enemy uses the second skill. Okay, so for the second skill, 
if you get hit by the second skill, this will happen to you guys. See that? Your world will be turned into sideways. So, even if you walk, see that? It's so cool, man. I really love this skill. Next up, guys. Uh, just a warning, you might get dizzy. The first time that I saw this, guys, this is a slow-mo. What if this is faster and you have astigmatism like me? Yeah, this will be hard. Whoa. But anyway, that's it for the skills. Do you like this? For me, this is the best. How about you guys so far? Comment it on the comment section. Okay, next up, we have the Blood Bewitchment Art by 22,500 cash. Let's try it for the first skill. Oh, oh we only have two skills for this art. Really looks cool, right? So if you're inside that skill, you will see this. So it, for me, it's better compared to the previous art for my eyes. <laughs> Next up for the second skill. There you go. You see that, guys? Okay. Let's see now. Oh, guys, this is gross. For me, this is gross. The first time I saw it, ew. <laughs> ew, guys. So this will only. Take effect if you are in front of your enemy, okay? If you're if you're not in front, it won't take effect. And this one, as long as you're within range, if you're not looking at your enemy, everything's good, okay? Next up, we have the Dream Art. Again, it costs 22,000 cash. Let's try it. This art only has two skills. That's the first skill, damage and stun. Okay, there you go. For the second skill, it's almost the same. It's just that, oh, there's, this looks like a poop, right? <laughs> a poop skill with stun and damage. Not bad, but guys, it only has two skills, so I prefer uh, arts that has more skills. More fun, right? More skills, more fun. But again, it only costs 22,000 cash. Okay, so I think we're on our last, yeah, last demon art. And I know this is the one you've been waiting for, the Shockwave Art. This is the one that is being used by one of the bosses here. Demon boss in this game. So let's see guys, every time you activate that, see that? That will appear. For the first skill, there you go. Shockwaves. Guys, notice it. First skill, kicks. Second skill, punches. And the third skill is Shockwave that will push your enemy. This doesn't do damage, I think, yeah, from what I remember. So guys, what do you think? What demon art is your favorite? Comment it on the comment section. We're just gonna defeat the boss here using the shockwave demon art. <laughs> oh, by the way, this boss is the one that's using it too. Well, I hope that you enjoyed this video. You learned something from it. Guys, I made this video so that you won't need to like waste your cash on unlocking others, okay? Again, AFS video tomorrow. Thank you for all the support. This is GamerNom. And GamerNom out.